For side to side, we're gonna lie on our backs with our knees bent feet together, and your hands are gonna rest out to the side of the room. We're gonna start with the prep to really get the activation. So all you're gonna do is let your knees drop over to one side. And then as you sigh out, you're gonna rotate your ribs, tummy, hip to come back to center, and we're gonna go through the other side. So you want to be able to feel that your head can move in the opposite direction because you're getting that spine mobility. And this is a really important way to kind of get that activity through your spine so we can move a bit further when we're exercising. So you're just gonna sigh, really feel your ribs roll over, tummy will follow, hips will follow, and that way you'll get that activity through your oblique muscles. So if this is enough for you, you're gonna stay here. But otherwise, from there, we're gonna do one more, and then I want you to come up into our tabletop. So you're gonna bring one leg up to tabletop and then the other. Again, glue your legs together from your big toe, knees, and inner thigh, and we're gonna have a gentle squeeze. So again, you're gonna tip your legs over to one side, your pelvis will follow, so will your abdominals. Your head will drop over to the other side. And as you sigh, we're gonna bring ourselves back exactly the same way we did with our feet on the floor. You should end up in 90-90 in the middle, and we're gonna roll over to the other side. So as you go back, almost imagine that you're gonna press through your bottom inner thigh as well. So we're getting those side stomach muscles and your inner thighs working, which will all lead to that deep abdominal strength. So this should be very much an activation exercise. We wanna keep those shoulders nice and heavy into the floor. Use that breath out, feel that side tummy working. We're gonna do one more each side. And then pause in the middle. Take one leg down and the other. 